Have I not mentioned Palmeiras at some point in this month's scouting report playlist? I think I did with Roger Guedes, didn't I? Well, we're now going to meet someone who actually plays for this club. And he is a Colombian midfielder at the age of 25. And his name is Eduard Atuesta. I had looked at Palmeiras' team. Some players are extremely good. It's one of the most popular clubs in Brazil. And Eduardo Tuesta is proven to be quite a popular midfielder. He's had to play in other leagues as well, just to strengthen his own game. But he really found his feet while he was playing in the MLS. Because he finally found a position and a formation that he could use and that he could learn from. And that has helped him to become the player he is today. Atuesta started playing for Independiente Medellin when he was young. And he moved to LAFC in 2018 on a loan deal. He later made that a permanent signing, playing under Bob Bradley. He was voted into the MLS's Best 11 team in 2019 and was an MLS All-Star in 2021. In 2021, he moved to Palmeiras. He's had a lot of success in Brazil. He's won a league title, uh, Campeonato Paulista, if I've said that correctly, and a Recopa Sudamericana. Palmeiras also got to the semi-final of the 2022 Copa Libertadores, with him playing a major role in the team's cup run. His style of play was heavily influenced by his time in America. Bob Bradley helped to develop a twister by playing him in a 4-3-3 formation and encouraging him to be better off the ball. A twister has subsequently become a very high pressing midfielder who forces opponents into passing a lot quicker than expected. He plays as a number six usually, and when he's on the ball, he focuses on moving it. He maintained an 80% passing accuracy through the 2019 season and still aims to do this by his own admission. He analyzes opponents both on and off the ball and does this with haste yet sensibility. He also analyzes open teammates for passes and that's helped him to assist more. He admits that he has found the transition from Colombian to American football a lot different because Colombian football is very technical and quite skillful with that South American flow with it. It wasn't like that in America, he said. In America, he focused more on ball retention. At first, he admitted it was a little bit difficult, but he eventually grew into this. He eventually got it in his head that he was going to be able to move the ball a lot more from other positions. Um... Yeah, I think him playing in the MLS is something that should not have its nose turned up at. Because he's, he's had a lot of success since he left the MLS. And it was probably the best thing for him to leave so that he could grow. Palmeiras has been the perfect place for him to grow. I think he is ready to play in Europe. And his career could take massive strides if he were to move to Europe. I would welcome him to Europe with no problems. Um, for West Ham, we need pressing players. And that we need a presser of the ball. This guy would press. This guy would do it and wouldn't think twice about getting his hands dirty. Thank you very much for watching this video. Eduard Twester, will he swap South America for London? Will he get on that big white bird and fly across the ocean? I don't know. Buy my plane ticket if he wants to come because I'll gladly meet him at the airport. Trust me.